Hello, my creatures of the night, my brothers, my sisters, my children. Hello, Pittsburgh, PA. It's 8.30 in the PM, and if anybody's listening, you are on the Justin Cohen Podcast, where everything is solid, everything is awesome, everything is cool. Coming to you live from the inside of my living room, if you actually care. Anyways, Halloween's coming up. Are you kitties excited? Time to get your free candy and your free cavities. Dentists will be happy about that. I remember when I was a kid, I used to go up as a T-Rex. Mind you, I used to wear that costume all year round, so Halloween was every day for me. Speaking of costumes, what are you going to be dressing up as? A sexy Wonder Woman? A stud muffin Batman? Hey, I have an idea. Why don't you call me and tell me your scariest Halloween story? Caller, you are on the air. Tell us, what is your scariest Halloween story? Yeah, in the garbage. What the hell is this? She got two of them? Come on, hon. Where are you? Babe, you're, uh, you're funny. You kind of have me freaked out a little bit, actually. Elizabeth! Hey, what's up, Justin? I really enjoy your show. I got a scary story for you. There's an urban legend about a cursed tree from an old village that existed over a century ago, I think. The village supposedly burnt down, but the tree was rumored to still remain. Since then, the tree was probably cut down and used for, I don't know, lumber or whatever. But I was wondering, what if the tree made its way out into the world? If the tree really did hold a curse, and if the tree was made into paper, table chairs, whatever you want to say, I wonder if the curse would still exist. So let me get this straight. If someone was to, say, cut this tree down and make it into, oh, I don't know, a baseball bat, and then you took that baseball bat and gave it to a team, would that team then be cursed? Yeah, exactly, that's what I'm saying. You should tell your audience to take a road trip up the Black Ridge and buy some rocking chairs and, I don't know, wooden sled named Rosebud and see if that shit is cursed. Uh, that's the last thing you want to do. So... No. Next!